Hey guys, I am back with another Payday video. I haven't played the game in a while, so... I already did the, the pre-planning, so... Here I am going to play as Mr. Pink from Reservoir of Dogs, my favorite character. Don't ask why I didn't brought a saw, because... I thought I'll just go bring some two EFC jammers because who says this is a bad idea? Because Mr. Pink could get some good money for the stealth wraith. Okay. I'll wait here. Shao, if you need me to pop some motherfuckers. Yeah, let's pop some motherfuckers. Oh, if you're probably wondering, that's a I'll also wait. our med I'll arch hang medic. I'll around in case you need firepower. You check the place. I'll yeah, here. a stealth wraith EOT medic. This is probably Interheist universe mixed with Payday. Oh. Don't ask why there's no Jack Double Ludo, Mr. Mundy, aka Sniper, Nathan, Strike Force Heroes. Wait. There no, there's no Nathan, no Sniper, and no Ludo. Oh, we also forgot there's no Mike, which is Sparrow's fiance, no Jack Paul, or the Operative, aka Vince Jr. Oh, if you're probably wondering, is in that slot suit? Probably it's Sparrow. Don't ask why Sparrow has a suit rack, because they're all, all your AI heisters was scripted to smoke. So here's Mr. Pink who's gonna do his job. Mr. Pink, do what you need to do. We're good. Guard. Let's do this. Get your game face on, buddies. Get down, all of you. Yeah, you can Everybody see Dallas down. himself. Down, all of you. Get the people on the floor. Get them down. down. Get down, people. Everybody down. And stay there. Keep track, guys. Don't move. Keep Stick cool, man. Stay down, everybody! Stay down, everybody! 
Stay down, all of you. Stay down, all of you. Don't worry about his voice. I'm using legendary armor skins. Oh, I'm going to put on my glasses. Stay down, people! Yes, I'm having my bots chat. Like, my allies, my teammates chat, because sometimes I'll get lonely. We know, Bane. Just chill. Relax, mate. Everybody on the ground! Get down! Don't All think about it, Bobblehead Bob. Also, don't worry about their names. Like the to my 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 colleagues or my teammates. Set. Don't you ground. even think Get I down. forgot about you? you? Come along now. Come on. Come with me. Move it. Come on.
down, all of you. I know Mr. Pig is supposed to have a squeaky voice, but... Like what he had in the video in the game of Reservoir Dogs. <coughs> yeah, still sick at the moment, but still feeling better. My mom made me take a cough drop, and I didn't like the taste of it. Even though she tried to give me some something to some liquids, I don't I'm bothering to take that. How bad it tastes, it makes me gag. I always wonder what if hey, what if Overkill makes a Sydney plushie. Here we go. We should be through in a couple of minutes. Not all, they can also block the view of civilians.
Looks like Mr. Pink also has to pick all the locks.
Thank you. 
I always wish that there could be LAS in his base as like a like a legendary armor skin base that you, that could help you. So you won't have to rely on it reverse engineering other people's LAS. <laughs> Alright, since everyone's hostage, now I can. Now all I have to do is. Yeah, my computer isn't that bright. I was planning to get a new, either a new video card, so I can get a better view, but this computer cannot be upgraded, so 
might have to have a professional upgrade this game. Yeah, I, I, I would have actually just... I, I would have actually just... Forget, uh, forget about all of the lock picking. Instead, I could just actually just go to the van. But no, I'd rather get the good money. Swear if I want to, if yeah, I hope I don't have COVID since I got the vaccine. That's a furry thing, but no, I am not a furry. I was planning to get the bunny ears for my avatar since I would really thought I've like been a good kitty for a long time. Like, yeah. Sometimes I have a younger brother, he, he usually calls me furry because of the cat ears I have on my Luxian avatar. Oh yeah, my Starbound character, Sarota. Yeah, she's a cat girl, but some, my brother calls her a furry. But Nikos are not furry, they're cat girl. Cappy's not I would have thought the drawing of my Roblox and Roblox avatar like falling the walls like my cat would be. So I'm planning to make a video on Xeno Fighters on the X-43, one of the most OP planes and strikers. And <laughs> I 
I just got a fucking document. An old one. I though lack experience in making fucking animations or art. Usually I thought of like making like Ninja over girlfriend. Like probably I have a friend that might make it, though. So. Like I would have thought like the ninja from the ninja mod. Yeah, usually I would have thought I would have seen it my ninja. I would make my ninja. I don't have a thing. I have lots of pragmatic stuff. And sometimes I don't feel motivated to do that. Although, I would also thought to make my robot counterpart. I usually like these over girlfriend mods. Like, I like how they sit in the speakers. I also thought of making one of my friends One of my robots. Yeah, me and my fr my fr Roblox friends. One of my Roblox friends, like, we play Entry Point. But not that often. Usually I tend to mess up on it. Though she, they do play Funky Friday, but though they are not interested in the original Friday Night Funkin'. left is, is, all that's left is S, T, U, V, W, X. These people must use the freaking alphabet. Alphabet, I mean. hope for an entry mod point mod an entry point mod for payday 2 and probably a taser dozer las legendary armor skin i always wanted a legendary armor skin and probably the enemies too yeah. i would also like to have some spec offs the line yes, it's probably a recreation of Nathan from Strike Force Heroes 2, and maybe. Well, there was once a TF2 LAS, but it was removed. The owner was Mako. I don't know why they removed it, but I, I it's not necessary to know. So I want I would think of a sniper LAS. Like, so I can make the full reservoir of heisters. Like all I need is Lugo. And I need Lugo, Nathan, and Mr. Monkey, aka Sniper from TF2. Though there are no entry point or slash roll blocks, LAS is on. On payday two. So if I, I would have like used the main heister that I'm going to play as, I would have thought to make the operative, aka Finch Jr., Freelancer's son. It's 
just fan-made. This is an alternate universe of entry point. I wouldn't think I would use the, the player either as Mike or Sparrow. I found out what Mike looked like, although he looks a bit like Fire Street, but not that much. He probably has this bandana around his neck, but it's not in his mouth. He doesn't wear shades. He's a former Phoenix operative, though, a Sparrow's fiance. I would have fought for Sparrow because she's more easier to use. I used to remember back in Brock Scout, there was this teacher I liked called Mr. Berryhill. He's a great teacher, like, even though he talked about history, my favorite subject in school. Oh, also, back when I was in Brock Scout, I used to go on this thing called Edmodo. Kinda sucked, though. And I enjoyed it. So I did some, recently some, inappropriate bad stuff back then, but it's a thing in the past. Weird stuff, I mean. I did made, I placed the entire lyrics of Curtis the Word on it. I was kind of a troublemaker back when I was in Brock's Gap. Uh, on the final days of school, I went. There was this person named Miss Eichenkale. She, uh, I liked her too. Oh, also, I also liked Miss Clark. Miss Clark, I usually liked her. She had a son named Stephen. Like, no, uh, that's important. Miss Clark is a good person. I do like her. Well, usually back when I was in the final days of Brock, when I was in the final days of Brock's Gap, other fun fact, off topic again, there was this guy named Ryan McSwain, like, he had some interest on, interest though, but not as that's important. I also... Oh, usually, okay, back on the main subject. Usually, sometimes back at Brock's Gap, also again, I usually called myself Scott. Yeah, probably impersonating the principal, Scott Mitchell. It was kind of funny back then. Some of the girls called me it, some of my friends do too. Usually, I've been a troublemaker sometimes before. Well, usually, though, this changed. I remember back when I was in Boston, I called it a ghost. I used to feel like I would know it. Although there were no chairs, I had to kneel down. I hurt my knees, but I, I dealt with it. It was kind of funny that. No one was around Miss Eichengel's room, and I apparently didn't got punished, for, got in trouble for it. No one even knew. Now let's check if all the all the deposits are picked. 
We got this row. <laughs> And that one too. I was thinking on getting the gauge packages. I kind of miss Greenwood back then. Yeah, I used to go to Greenwood. That was my own. Now, oh, Mr. Pink is going to, to cover. Yes. I also thought, like, if the Bone Crushers had a descendant, like a successor, it would be called the Crush Bones. Okay, we can leave now, but try and take it all if you can. That's all, yes, boys. Yes, tightest crew ever. Don't ask why you have to do pizza fields. I, I remember the plan to change your life. See you this evening, guys. <laughs> to make a doll. Oh, I need supplies. They are not good at it. I might have plans to make a doll of... Yep, thanks for watching, guys.